A bizarre case of vandalism in Macomb County tonight after the sign at a dentist's office was destroyed. Happened on Summer Street near downtown Utica, just a block west of Van Dyke. But as Nick Monticelli reports, not necessarily the sign that caught our attention. Good evening. I'll be honest with you. Normally a story about a vandalized sign wouldn't be something in the news. But let me show you something here. This is what's going to change this entire story. This sign that was vandalized just wait until you hear how much it's going to cost to replace it. I had to drag it back into the uh, garage after it broke. Dr. Chris Manduzzi, his wife Jackie, and their entire dentistry team are at a conference right now, but there is still talk about this, the fancy sign outside of their Utica dental office that no longer exists. A few days ago, the mayor's wife here was walking early in the morning, saw this, snapped a picture, and Chris came right over. They knew instantly this was not an accident. It definitely wasn't a car. Uh, there were some footprints in the snow, it just like looked like a single set of footprints. Um, so yeah, our assumption is vandalism. Footprints in the snow, as you heard, makes them believe this was intentional. Now they're offering a $500 reward to figure out who did it. Well, we just can't understand how somebody could do this number one, but number two, not come forward. I mean, if you if you come home from the bar and you do something stupid, at least hopefully your conscience will bring you to, you know, kind of admitting up to it later. Will it be replaced? Yes, they're working with insurance because to do that, it'll cost five figures. I've spoken to the gentleman that built it for me. Um, it's it's looking like about $10,000. It's custom built, like I said, it's not wood. You know, wood would be actually a lot more brittle and wouldn't stand up the test of time. You know, he was trying to make it out of a nice material that would uh, last in the crazy weather conditions we have here in Michigan. It's just a really, you know, sad feeling for humanity that people could do something so horrible. In Utica, Nick Monticelli, Local 4. And hard to believe in this day and age, but no security cameras around apparently recording what happened. So as you heard, there is a $500 reward for information. If you know anything, you're asked to call the Utica Police Department.